Oh, lightning. Okay. Oh, I can swap abilities here. Uh, Sick Chain Lightning. Or Venom Punch. Well, the Dash does the same thing. I mean, Lightning is multiple. Now I'm going to keep Chain Lightning for now. I always like the Venom Punch. There are things that add to game experience. Yep. Oh. Hey, Mars. Getting used to hearing that voice, man. Dropped you a pin. Oh, hold that thought. That car's swerving all over the place. Wait a minute. Drive! Drive! Is there a street race I don't know about? Excuse me. I had sense of taste only. One ton of runaway meadow brought to a halt. We'd love to see it. Please enjoy the commendations. Your resting officers will be here in a few minutes. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, I'm Glaren. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah. I was just giving you space after you got out. You don't need it. Besides. We gotta settle some things. We do. See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. Got any wind pipes? No. Uh, yeah, yep, this is New York. I mean, it could be Brooklyn, but we never know. Another day, another disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what should have been. Spider-Man! This is all part of the process. Sorry, ladies and what was the deal with those guys? Oh God! Better tell Pete about them. Oh God! Look at his legs. I don't think the I don't think my Steam Deck is working at the moment, but look at the look at the legs of this man. Oh God! Oh no! That man ain't walking any time soon. <laughs> I'm actually enjoying watching you I appreciate it. Not my birthday, guys. No need for the surprise. Ooh. I'm trying to help you out here. Goodbye, man, Sandman.
Okay, what is this? All this trouble for a little crystal. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. I haven't seen Marco in years. I would have been there for him if I knew he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. I get all four of them together so I can squinch that uh Y'all caught that, but I caught that. I really don't see anything romantic. Oh, do you see that shot? Spider-Man? Yeah. Actually, use a new one. Whether it's on the stage or in the open air, where else can you see legends and soon-to-be legends performing every day? London? That's really far away. You said, oh God, my life is in the hand of programmers. And it is, cause uh, he's like, box. Bomb reported up ahead. Did whip strike. Uh, let me make sure I know what I'm doing.
Uh, tech pots. The friendly neighborhood minutes. Fireworks. Rude. Better warn those guys they're illegal here without a permit before someone calls the cops on. I can't remember how to play through swinging sessions. We really got to do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. <laughs> Your dad used to give me that exact same look. <laughs> Kid? Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. Aww. You getting some? How did you... Miles, that Lee business, don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? How school? College? Anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just messed up my landing. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code for my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Ooh. Not back here. Move to be a where you can... Oh. Another gate. Okay, I can dig this. Can't pull it open from down here. Oh wait. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Got it. Wanna finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. 
feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Uh, you see, wear tech parts. Use resources to unlock new suits, damage, uh, gadgets, and suit tech. Okay. You can boost combat and drive also capabilities by upgrading suit tech. Select health. Nice. I need more tech. Okay, I gotta stop failing the bus back, guys. This isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. Don't want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay, I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Estaba ayudando Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. Someone's playing with fireworks? Bad idea. Anyone see some robbers who are looking to lose a fight? I'll rip your head off, fighter! Excuse me. Really thought this fight was over just because you're on the ground? Somebody help me? You okay, good sir? There's an ambulance not too far away. I'll drop you right off. You're amazing. Thank you. I'm about to say I'm about to get hit. Would be hilarious if I landed and got hit by a car and he just dies. Take care. I can't thank you enough. Also, my boyfriend's your biggest fan. Wonder if Pete's done that many knockouts in one go. Don't judge me for being here. Yeah. Uh, surprise chest bump? Uh, map, 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 map. Cross the ocean? Yes, so we. What is this? Oh, rooftop. Right next to the spell. Oh, yes. Definitely doing that. Up there, remember? You on your way? Oh, right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. There we go. There's my path. City seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Heal the world, fair, uh, top fireworks. Wait. Okay, y'all are done. Take 
Take your place with the unworthy! Up. There we go. Probably shouldn't tell Ma about how close I got to an almost exploding gas truck. Woo. Fireworks. Better warn those guys they're illegal here without a permit before someone calls the cops on them. Here we go. There it is. I might have to move that somewhere else. <laughs> How would I get this to left? Gotta find the crane operation. Pretty simple. I really got to get used to was right. parrying. He did come after his tech. Everything good, kid? Got a few unauthorized access attempts for my stash in the shipping yard. Yeah. That group that took Lee showed up. They must be real good if they found him. Even your dad wasn't able to. Dad? It was the first showdown between Officer Jefferson Davis and Prowler. Had to hide in that shipping container for hours just to lose him. Almost wish he'd caught me right then and there. Never wanted him to get involved. Well, I'm glad you're out of the game now. Stay safe, Unc. Same, man. Will do. I hear it. There we go. My, I hear the fireworks. I just can't see the fireworks. I just need to. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. I'll just end it. Ah, where am I? Spider Man? Don't worry, I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. 
we, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved them, so we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Spider-Man. Wow. Hey, you get a... All right. There. The staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. Sweet. Hey, just dropped Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. You buy your sketchy fireworks? Bro, watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. And use camouflage for. We... Excuse me. And don't let the bed bugs bite. Spider must have done this. No, you don't say. No choice but to get Spider Man. Eh. Hey y'all! Excuse me. Okay, I can do that. That's cool. Birthday, Lex. Is that you? Oh man, I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Ooh. All right, so we're going to switch to Peter. Uh, I'm going to take a pee break right now and be back. If this actually works, but I'm seeing as it doesn't. Gonna do this manually. Switch button, it kind of broken. Which is sad, because I probably have to go back in there and see if I can fix it. Huh. 
Hey, Pete, you ready to come by the Foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this Foundation thing could be interesting. Oh. Oh, I can grab that. Nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader, some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get the story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I gotta get better at those type of actions. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Guys, you're kind of getting sand everywhere! You guys should really leave and go somewhere more tropical! Probably check out that crystal now. It's my turn to follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco must have felt so alone during all this. His back against the wall? I can find him. I gotta give some of these spiders some points. All I'm leaving my dogs out. Kumo suit? What is this? Oh my god, okay. I, I, I gotta try this suit out for just a bit. Fork is the big thing I want to update, especially now. Skills between them. Hey, what's up? Just want wanted to like long suit.
you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... Everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. Oh, especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> this is a weird ass suit. Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Frames. Fight pieces on me. <laughs> this suit is just wild. Fine, yes. I was looking for this. Marco memory scattered all over New York. Does anyone have sunscreen? And will one of you do my back, please? They won't give up. Definitely read up on Marco. Trip. Was. Oh, I went to the site. Uh, I forgot to pin the site quest. That 
it's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Particle accelerator, energy, culture. Uh, Dad, Pete space. hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know. Seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. <laughs> so the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Dr. Young, Dr. Young. Is that a new or... I should know Dr. Young, right? Not compatibly with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? Whoa, this is cool! These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting them, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves and not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep. A bee wolf. Oh, yeah. Why can't they be a wolves? Huh? Nice. Gotcha. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, well, I know. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. I'm in beesness. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about. 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. The body parts? I think there's a hole in there. <laughs> Harry! 
A moment, if you please. <gasps> Connors! Any chance they can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. That's precisely the issue. The accelerator is going to need a full recalibration. So much to see here. Where do I even start? I like my job. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. This is a mm -hmm. that next week is our softball team's first game. They even have a softball team? Oh, hell, can I join? as much as I can right now. Hey, 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 in my way of my exploration. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. How it ended up here. I believe you must be hands off the farm. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Mm -hmm. I Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. I would. I would definitely would be. I tried to regrow my arm, turned into a giant lizard. Definitely be the last time I test anything on me. Kind of radiation treatment, maybe? I wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. He has some dino DNA. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. That looks like Young's. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Can't get in there. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is being put to use saving lives. 
Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. The latest employee of the month is Clark from the Philippines. Congratulations, Clark. Did you hear about Roger? He's sick. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. Oh, so I have to go back down and try that. We're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. See you soon. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Mm. Let's see. Did it! Nice! Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great! Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source. Developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Mm. Okay, so. That. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Hmm.
Okay, if I combine these traits... Beautiful work, Peter. There we go. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wait, two years! I knew a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I... Put it. Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. The latest employee of the club is Clark from facility. Go ahead. Congratulations. Swipe. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, that was about to both know you're the smarter one. Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? Kind of low. That one in the family like there. It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> Quick thing. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> I wonder how fast before this job goes haywire. Like shit, something about to break. <laughs> <laughs> 